Hey guys, welcome back to another episode. This is your boy Rick. Today's episode, we're going to be reviewing the Black & Decker and Ryobi. Boom! 12 volt drill motors. Let's see who wins. All right guys, so for the Black & Decker, we got the 12 volt drill motor, model number GCO1200C. This bad boy comes with a two year warranty. The Black & Decker only comes with one battery and a charger. It's only got one speed, but it's got a 22 position clutch, 750 RPM motor, but unlike most other drills, it doesn't come with a carrying case. It doesn't come with the extra battery or the LED light. It also does come with a two year warranty. And really that's about it for this bad boy. This is the Ryobi 12 volt drill motor. It's the model HJP004. It's got a lithium ion battery. It only comes with one battery, no carrying case. It comes with a charger, of course. It's a 3 8 chuck. It's got 22 positions, but it's only got one speed on this model. It's got a belt clip, pretty cool, love belt clips. Anytime you're working up above and you don't wanna have the drill in your hand, cool to have a belt clip. It comes with a double end bit. You can store it right on the drill. The Royalty model comes with an LED light, pretty cool. Again, pretty standard nowadays for most drills. Uh, everybody's, you know, going to the LED light a little bit brighter, always cool to have. It's got a nice grip on it. I like it, you know, pretty good. I like. It. The Black & Decker drill comes in at three pounds even. The Ryobi drill comes in at two pounds, seven ounces. Black & Decker 12 volt came in at 21 minutes and 52 seconds, just under 22 minutes before it died out. So the Ryobi 12 volt drill came in at 22 minutes and five seconds. All right guys, so this is the final showdown between these bad boys, the Ryobi, $50, got the Black & Decker, $30. As far as accessories, they both come with a double-ended bit, you know, driver. They both come with a charger, one battery each. Charger looks kind of cheap for the Black & Decker. Not really big on this one, and it's real cheap. The Ryobi's looks a little more sturdier. This honestly comes down to one of those, uh, it, you get what you pay for. 30 bucks for this bad boy. Honestly, it's it felt real cheap. The plastic feels really cheap. Like, drop it once, it'll probably break on you. But 30 bucks, I mean, that's what you're getting. One speed, no LED light, no clip. So, you know, really you always have to have it in your hand. You can't clip it on the side. Real bulky, came in at three pounds. Ryobi came in at two pounds, seven ounces. It's got a huge battery, can't even take this thing off. It's got a huge battery. Oh, that thing's simple to take off, love it. So, with the Ryobi, you're gonna get the LED light. Love these things, always cool to have those. You know, you're gonna get more power. You guys saw the, the test. So this thing didn't even have enough torque, you know, to get the, the screw all the way down in the wood. This thing's got a really cool grip, I like that. You know, I'd probably buy this for like my grandma or something, you know, or someone who's not really gonna do a whole lot much with it, you know, maybe put in a couple of screws to hang a picture or something. Ryobi definitely, you know, it'll get you through some jobs around the house if you're a do-it-yourself type of person. I'd go with this all day. Warranty, you're gonna get two years with the Black & Decker. The Ryobi, you're gonna get three years. All day, hands down, I'd probably go with the Ryobi. If you're balling on a budget, 30 bucks all day, go ahead and take the Black & Decker. I don't know, what do you guys think? Ryobi or the Black & Decker? So just wanna thank you guys for tuning in today's episode. Ryobi, Black & Decker, you know, maybe you guys will get the Ryobi. Some of you guys might get the Black & Decker. If you like what you saw, go ahead and smash that like button. If you guys wanna go ahead and pick some of these bad boys up, Got the links below, right down here somewhere. And, uh, you know, go ahead and subscribe to the channel if you guys like it. So once again, thank you, and we'll catch you guys next time. Okay.